Hi, Crafty Wands. Pam here. Pam Vinny with Pam's Paper Place. And I just wanted to say hello. And I went to the Goodwill Outlet. And I have a few things to show you. Um, supplies that I can use for a junk journals. So I'm going to show you. i got this little case. I know you can get this at the Dollar Tree. But I think it's kind of cute. And then inside, just a regular pen. And then... What are these? Mild ink zebra brush. I'm not familiar with these. Mild liner brush, double ended, super fine. Well, oh, these are cute little grid papers. I didn't know they were grid, but let's just see. So there's that tip. Oh, yeah, they're kind of pretty. So there's a bonus. Yeah, they're kind of nice. So I got some different colors. And if I don't use them, I can always give them to my granddaughter. And I like the little pouch. So I got that. Then I just, um, I have some cards too. I think those are upstairs. But Then I just got little um, markers or bookmarks and little things you could put in journals kind of cute you know because you're always looking for something you can put in a journal so I got that then I got some napkins these are really pretty look how pretty those are and there's quite a few in here Celebrate the home. So they were virtually from Marshalls. But so a big stack of those. I need to really use my uh, napkins more. Uh, here's some cute Santa ones that were from Hallmark. Cute. And I got two packs of these, which I really love. Uh, they'd be great to uh, use on tags decoupage made in Germany romantic roses really pretty so I was really excited about that beautiful shabby chic I got some paint brushes really tiny brushes and then I just got a little a few little vintage um like little booklets, you know, a little to put in a, like a cookbook or journal. Look at those. Those are fun. Nordic Ware, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Don't really see a uh, year, but it looks pretty old. And then Craftsmanship. Look at that picture. <laughs> and you got some knitting. Look at that card again. This, this uh, looks like 70s here. Look at that tennis sweater. Kind of funny. So, got that. And then there's Today's Woman. Sewing Simplified. And look at that. She's all fancy with her when she's sewing. I don't know why she's wearing a coat, but anyway. Here we are. Look how yellow that is. So you have some kind of yellow sewing book pages. That's fun. Images. Awesome. Really yellowed uh, pages. Okay, we got, uh, what is it, 1971? That's what it looks like, 1971. Awesome. Then I found this Mead Primary Journal. 
And I've never seen one like this with that. It's blank. You probably draw a picture, maybe, or I don't know. And then um, that's kind of awesome. Brand new. Put in journal for pages. I like that. You just find random things. And this is like some cute little mittens. Uh, and our state is kind of called the mitten, the mitten state, because uh, Michigan's shaped like a mitten glove. So that's cute. That could be on a charm dangle. Just fun little different things. And then this looks like a little vintage ornament. That'd be fun on a maybe a tassel. Really pretty. I got the Treasury of Christmas Stories. And it has cute stories with fun little illustrations. Look at Secret in the Barn. Aren't they cute? Illustrated in black and white. So lots of fun little stories. Treasury of Christmas Stories, 1960. So we've got fun little Christmas stories in here. I like the cover too, it's really cute. I don't know if it's just plain. Yeah, it's a plain green cover. I got the Compton's Precyclopedia, volume 14, letter S. It's a beautiful cover. Look at the cute little squirrel and seal. Nineteen seventy seven. Very fun. I haven't made any real journals this month. I don't know. I don't want to really start a project right now, but I will be ready in January to really get moving on some things because I have so many supplies. I need to, uh, you know, make some journals. So that's a really pretty book. I even got this little tray. I think you can get this at the Dollar Tree, but I do have some like this, so I thought I'd, you know, with this pretty on the side, so I got that. Uh, what other things? I got some of these cutouts. They're little bees. And I thought they were cute if I still had my little, uh, if I still had my Busy Bee General Store that I had for my grandkids, I'd put that in the little store. I, I took a garden shed and made a general store out of it, but they've kind of outgrown that, so I'm gradually moving things out of that, although it makes me kind of sad to take it all out. I had shelves and little canned goods and fruits and vegetables and signs and um, shopping carts and baskets, and um, so it was really fun. I hear, gee, that was $7, $6.99, but it, it looks like a vintage uh, ribbon for Christmas. Ooh, that's pretty, too. No, I think I'm going to sneeze. Um, oh, and I have... Excuse <coughs> me. This, like, candy cane stick ribbon. That's pretty. So I'll put that with my Christmas things. And then I got some glitter tool. That'd be pretty for Christmas or... Oh, that's pretty. I think that might have, that came from the Dollar Tree too. So, um, and then I just a little gingerbread guy for next year. Kind of cute. And then a tiny. I found a tiny little gingerbread guy. Ah, a little face. I got a little booklet to do. Be happy. That's right. Let's be happy. Oh, December can be a little... I don't know why it's hard sometimes. But, um, yeah, sometimes it just is. I found this Moonlight White Archival Pigment Ink Pad in Brilliance. Looks fairly new. Moonlight White. Yeah. So, there's kind of a fun ink pad. 
Uh, I got one sticker sheet of uh, it's an Easter sticker. Really pretty. And this is almost looks like this might have come from the Dollar Tree. Well, that's really pretty for spring. And then I found some stamps. I, just, I like wood stamps. Look how pretty this pansy pansy border is. Isn't that pretty? Oh, and it's called Pansy Border Hero Arts. And I have they say you're only young once. How was it? <laughs> Kind of funny and then a little flowers here stamping up another pretty stamping up all right what's going on here pretty border flowers and the last one is a little acorn leaf stamping up I like those and then, what else do we have? Just a few more things. This little bag has these like old fashioned icicles. And then these little wood, I like, I like these little wood, um, wooden ornaments. Mm, not so much that, but with this little angel. I don't know if that's a drum. Cute. We have this. Oh, he's got his hand broken. Looks like a little monkey with a hat. That might be. Yeah, I can. I can glue that on. Here's a girl. Cute. It needs to be cute for tassels too. Looks like maybe this might have been her wings or somebody's wings. What's this? A bell? A bell. We have a little snowman. We have another little drummer boy. I can clean them up, fix them. And look at this. Merry Christmas. I mean, some of these could be in my dollhouse, too. And then they must have just took some uh, Chanel pipe cleaners and made a candy cane. So that's what I got from the Goodwill outlet. And... Um, these are will be added to my journal supplies. So thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And uh, this is my Thrifty Thursday, which is uh, hosted by um, Sherry at Turquoise Streaming. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.